Mm -mm, we're pushing hour 15 here. Uh, a shower in bed sounds so wonderful right now. A shower in bed? Uh, a shower and bed, I said. Shower in bed. I'll be able to do both those things. Oh, freedom. Yeah, I should go back to smooth braining it. I don't got time for this chat. I got time to attack with white creatures this time. Ugh. Oh, fudge, dude. The 24 hours have novelty, but yes, I shouldn't. 24 hour streams are also just bad, health wise and otherwise. And we got time for one more draft before I do. All right, all right, now wait a minute. Maybe we sneaky jeeky. Hmm. <laughs> My brain is getting wrinkly all of a sudden. <laughs> no, if I really feel awful, I'll call it. I'm not completely dead yet. Minus one hour per trophy. That's actually a good idea. 24 hour stream, minus one hour for every trophy acquired. Like, I've only acquired four right now. What time would that go to? Uh, 20 hours, or uh, it'd be five more hours. I don't think you would have to do plus time for missed trophies. It's a lot harder to get trophies than it is not. All right, I mean, I think Vamps might be the best card, but since I took the Deceiver, I'm going to take the Recruit. Gush? Gush or back to Smooth Brain Blade Splicer? All right, maybe I'm back to Smooth Braining it. I don't know. Hmm. Huh? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. People fighting online. Uh -uh. Oh, then they ignore each other, yeah. <laughs> yeah, maybe I'm back to smooth brain. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> <laughs> Yarnto! Thank you for the five gifted Subarinos. Tree speaker on the wheel. Come on. No wait. This is not even this is what what pick is this? Pick five hundred? Tree speaker? <sighs> okay, maybe. Mm. Eh, back to smooth. <laughs> Uh, I don't think we want soul fire. No, we're just building like three different decks. No big deal. We're in mono white. We have sneak attack Kiki or sneak attack deceiver. We also have green ramp with tree speaker Karn. Primus goes into both sneak attack and green over there. Yeah, Mom Draft is guaranteed two wins. Maybe at this point I should just take the guaranteed two wins. Oh my lord. Yeah, green feels open. I mean, come on. All right, fine. Fine, fine, fine. I'll take the tree, or I'll t rather I'll take the uh, Emrakul here. See? It's still super easy to build a deck, chat. That's how you do it. You waffle, 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 waffle. And then you eat falafel. 
and then you just feel awful. Just sneak attack Ugin. Checkmate. Uh, I'm not hungry. No nugs. Why do I want to take Narset here? Or Renin 6. You know what? I'm going to take Renin 6. Conscripts. Conscripts is pretty good, but man, this signet is perfect. Dak, Pyro, Dryad, Conscripts, Abrade, Ewit. I'm going to just take the Siggy. I need Wheel of Fortune or Fauna Shaman slash Survival, I guess. I need more card filtering and selection. The problem with the red green deck is that when you're trying to find your com uh, specific pieces, it's it's all up to the top of your deck usually. Okay, well, library is a nice one. It's a very late fracture. Pretty late bolt too, but gotta go with what we're given. Mom's going crazy over there. Oh, Tyrant Timber. Another pretty good one for the fatties. I'm in for that. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'm going to go with Canal. I might want to take some blue cards later. Damn it, wish I had taken the Temple Garden now. I don't recall the Mirai's Wake, but if I could remember it, or if I remembered it could wheel, I would have taken it. Hey, Crash Maxwell, thanks for the two month sub. Jeez, that balance. Uh, we'll go with Spellseeker in case I get channel last pack. I've hated Whisperwood since the dawn of time. Armageddon. No. Meh, I don't need this. I already have Claim and Sage. Alright, channel. Mm, or something. That's a pack. I'm not taking the... Mind twist, I'm going to take the Nissa here over Hierarch. Nissa is another, another way to hard cast or cheat. Raffle Copter is kind of like a channel, especially when it's so heavy green. Sorry, Verdant. Uh, hey, that's a pack. Natural Order, Crater Hoof, Demonic Tutor, Kozilek. I don't really have that many mana dorks. I think I'm going to take another fatty to cheat out. Gorge here over Questing Beast or Power Stone. Oof, that's nice. Through the Breach. If I had taken the Conscripts, Kiki Jiki would be good. 10 mana Utamog, or... Oftentimes this doesn't win on the spot, but it's close. If I had, if I had channel, I'd take Ulamog, but I don't, so let's just take Garrick here. Let's take Steve over Chain Lightning, or... Actually, top? How many shuffle effects do I have? Yeah, I guess Steve is better. Sakura Tribe Elder called Steve. The first three of each word. 
Actually, we have no reason to run Ren and Six, do we? Oh, we're almost there, chat. I just need a little bit more. Damn, what a wheel. I'm almost into the second wave portion of the stream. I just, I need to hold strong. We're almost to the Pokemon, too. This might be the last draft of the day before we move over to the Ironmon stuff. These are the hard hours. These are the... I have another energy drink in the fridge. I don't really want coffee right now. Yeah, I'm gonna go do some push-ups or something after I build the deck. Oh my God. Oh my wow, God, wow, 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 wow. Kids. <laughs> uh, there were two mom drafts? 1.5. I'm illuminated because I turned off my ring light. It was too bright. Although maybe that helps me stay awake. Ah. Too bright. Actually, which... I think these lenses are higher. Same. Oh yeah, we have some eye drops, right? Yeah, I could use some eye drops, actually. That's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Where are they at in the bathroom? <clears throat> show you. One, two, three. I guess oh, we just run. Oh, no, I run the ballista instead of the Vorinclex. Really? Actually, Vorinclex and ballista? Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. Cut the nature's claim. Two mountains? Two mountains. Ah. All right, chat. This is a reasonable hand. It's not like broken, but it's really good. Could use one more forest, of course. I'm gonna kill it. Oh, I think. Chat. Why do I feel like they're gonna kill both my creatures next turn, and I'm gonna cry? No. Please. Just play a signet and let me draw forest. Please, forest! Please! Ah, two, four, five. Rip, dude. Guess I can play around days. Looks like they're gonna be storming on me. Oh baby, here we go. Really can't afford them having that much mana. We still might lose this turn because of the Electro, but... Still one mana off. Honestly, I think my best bet here is to kill the Electromancer. I think Electromancer, instead of t taking off their colors, is better, because that card can effectively add them you know, one, two, three, four, a ton of mana on any individual turn. Hopefully they just play like Memory Jar Pass and hope I don't kill them. Low Cousin, thank you for the six month sub! Okay, they might fizzle here. If, if there's a land on top, they just have to pass. Nice, there we go. Easy clap, fat baby. I'm actually feeling good now. A few push-ups actually put a lot of energy into me. Oh, I'm sorry, Tamarjo. Thank you for the 24 months. Yeah, I'm feeling good now. Like I said, once you get past that initial hump,
get the blood flowing a little bit. What is this clap fap? Uh, well, it's very obvious. I think. You clap, and then you fap. What? And fap stands for free associated press. Um, so you clap, and then, yeah, that's, that's all there is to it. We can uh, revoke the Lotus Bloom next turn, pretty nice. And now, now chat, I am going to draw Emrakul, and I'm going to make the opponent concede. I did. I played Emerald when it came out back in the day. That seems hard if there are so many double battles that you have to take, forced to play with a secondary. Uh-oh, they're high tiding. They're going to go off. <gasps> Maybe they don't know they can't use the bloom. Or... or maybe I'm dead? <laughs> Hopefully it's brain freeze. I have Emrakul and... Maybe it's just Emrakul. I didn't take a second Eldrazi, right? Yeah, it's 50-50. Either I win or I lose. Did I take Kozilek? I remember passing Ulamog, but it was the uh, the non-shuffle Ulamog. Okay. Palancron, that's not a brick, because that gives them four more mana. Thirst for Knowledge and Tendrils. Okay. I'm guessing we're dead, but we might not be, but I probably am, but maybe not. Overall, that was a very good tendrils for a small amount, or sorry, very good Mind's Desire for a small amount. Eight. Can you get one more spell? Oh, damn. All right, they have it all. Remember, the Tendrils is free to cast. I don't have any really good disruption for them is the issue. I mean, I guess the claim can come in since it's instant speed. That's probably good. Maybe this Dryad doesn't do much. <laughs> yeah, we can time it if it's instant speed. <laughs> Golly, man. This just gives them too much time if I don't draw anything. <sighs> yeah, it's a turn three Karn, don't you know, Kenji? I think I'm going to regret keeping that hand. Zero land keep. Easy. Easy clap. Easy fap. Play your brawl. Thank you. Mm, 16. 16. Ah! <laughs> 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 
Easy clap up. You do it, baby. Rune wise. Hey, thank you for the 16 months. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, do you, baby? Hmm? Okay. Mm hmm. I see you. I see you. What's up, Zen Shadow? One, two, two, four. Thank you for the nine months of. <laughs> oh, what was that? Ousty. Okay. <laughs> Mm. That was just annoying because I don't really want to redraw the uh, treetop. Later, later. Thanks for tuning in. Winds of Abandon. Okay. I don't actually mind them shuffling away my doo-doo. They know my hand is pretty junky, though. <laughs> Countered on every single turn, chat. All right, I have a plan. I'm thinking of a card. Is it sneaky? No, it's in fact breachy. Six permanents? Oh, seven. Breach! Oust incoming? What are you talking about? They shuffle. They, they made me shuffle after the oust. Oust. Oh my god. What the heck? Help! This actually seems like a fine matchup for us. If they just have a bunch of one for one removal like this. And some random nonsense. I mean, look at their life total chat. One good draw step is GG. We got one more draw at victory. This looks like a bamboozle here. They're actually mono white with a bunch of uh, fixing lands. So I'm sure they have like a time walk or something. The Arid Mesa grabs a blue source here. So pretty dead. I have two draws that immediately win the game here. Damn, damn, damn. In fact, I think they messed up paying there because a hoof killed them there instead. If, if I had drawn hoof instead of Primus, they would have taken exactly 11 as well. I don't think I bring in Ferocidon. I think we just run it back. Well, no, no. If, if instead of drawing the Primus, I drew hoof and then we drew the land, that was easy. But my deck doesn't poke in damage, so I don't think we want the Frost on. And Renin 6 pings one token at a time. It's too slow. I don't know. I mean, it, it's probably good enough. It's better than Dryad. Yeah, but on a token producer, like, I can kill one token and the rest of the tokens kill me. This hand is fantastic. Did I say the wrong one? Turn one Hierarch, turn two Wall of Roots, Sylvan Library. Turn three Prophet. They don't oust me. Sure. Actually, I'm going to go with Wall here because uh, I can Garrick a play next turn. Oh, they kept a one lander and got there.
Average Joe, thanks for gifting out a sub. Oh yeah, we're at a sub record for sure now. Wolf is black, a death touch. Mm -hmm. We can get one shuffle off if we want to. Lose our Garrick, but... Uh, I mean, I can probably afford to pay a bit of life here too. Damn. Runner, runner, land, boo. Four, five, six, seven. I don't want to sack any of my mana dorks, even though Death Touch plus Hoof is super good. Because if they just get rid of one of my mana dorks, then I wouldn't be able to cast the Hoof, you know? So this way, all I need to do is find a land, even if they get rid of the Druid. I don't know if there's anything really that they can have here. Well, Ballista doesn't win on the spot. It effectively wins. But Hoof literally wins. Yeah, I'm not sure why the student attacked. Why does one used to be in the cube? <laughs> they took it out not too long ago, but... Okay. So Slime is forced to go to the Gideon now. Sure. I have to ha I have to feel like they're still just dead here. No, actually maybe not. Oh wait, yes they are. No, wait, no they're not. They do survive, but is it really living? Okay. I mean, they have one card in their hand, two after drawing. I guess I don't have Trample anymore. That'd be pretty incredible if they pulled this out. It's not impossible but they're going to need two really good cards in their hand. Okay, one unknown card. They can activate a Danto, which makes a uh, lifelinker. That's a good attack. If they just block with the life linker, we kill them. The only way they survive here is if they double chump. So that's why I didn't do anything pre-combat, because I figured they were going to block like that. No, that wasn't greedy. That was, that was smart play. I don't actually love this hand versus them because they can just go underneath me drawing all these cards. Oh god, especially if they have power turn one. We might just lose to them being a turn ahead of us starting on turn one. Yikes, dude. Oh, 
man, what a curve out. Night, night. Don't know. <laughs> Ugh. <coughs> well, GG's. What a spicy draw they had, man. I guess that technically keeps me alive a turn. I don't think there's anything I can draw, though. Block, block, block. Oh, no, wait. I still take exactly lethal. Man, that sucks. But not much you can do versus the nut draw. Uh. All right, it's a keep and hope to get there. I mean, this is what I meant about this red green deck. There are going to be games where, because you don't really have a lot of filtering, you're just trying to find some pieces, you know? We've never seen Rafelos yet. That's not true. We had Rafelos uh, last match. It got ousted. No, no, it got. Uh, it got uh, Winds of Abandoned. Uh-oh. They might be storming for sure. Yeah, well, are you jealous of my 1-2? Arcbound Legion! Even with a 15 month sub. Six permanents? Darn. I was trying to summon Emrakul there. I'm gonna assume the Blooming Marsh is basically only for fast bond and I'm gonna blow up their blue source. If I had played Hierarch this turn, I'd be able to turn Timber next, but. I think this is better, especially given they didn't do anything last turn. This takes them off of potentially um, Time Twister, Time Spiral, a lot of the relevant cards. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm sure this will be fine. I'm sure I'm definitely not going to lose. What's the worst that could happen with... Oh, what's the worst that could happen? <sighs> oh, they're just going to grab Time Spiral proper. Do they have the other blue source, though? Or I guess they might Talisman for it. If I hit 3k subs, I'm going to do a 24-hour time spiral stream. Uh, maybe two 12 hours. How about that? Wait, pass! Oh, God! You know what? I bet you they thought they had it. I wonder if I'm supposed to just turn off Talisman now. God, I could... I could Symbiosis, but I don't think that's as good as just revoking on the... Uh, on the Talisman. Blowing up that island might have saved me the day. Blue or bust? Oh, I guess they're not dead, right? A. Oh, wait, that kills him. 
I was going to take Primus and blow up their Tropical, but I guess a six power hasty creature is probably good enough here. All right, I think we got a little bit fortunate there. I think they might have made a slight misstep. You know what? Huh. On that one turn, could. On the turn that they drew Time Spiral, did they have the mana to fetch for another blue source and spiral? I think they could have gone for it. They would have lost their... Were they one short? Okay, maybe they were one short. Gotcha, I see. Oh, I'm not, I'm not going to mulligan a turn two Rafelos, but... Oh, did you feed her? Okay. Freya, you were fed. Awkward. King Ruto, thanks for the 75 month sub. Oh, we're starting fresh, baby. Hot and fresh out the kitchen. Mama rolling that body, got every man in your wishing. Not me again? Zipping on coke and rum. It's the freaking weekend? No. No, it's not. I haven't heard that song in a long time. Yeah, it's because the artist who sings it is not a good person. Indeed, trash. I do my hair toss, check my nails. <laughs> yeah, after those push ups, more blood get into my brain. It was all in my butt. I want to just hard cast. Wait, what's there? There are 18. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, put them to 6. Forehead. Forehead. Flip my Garrick to set up lethal next turn. Kill me or die. Oh, shoot. This was really bad. I should have left Emrakul on top. If Brain Freeze is their win con, I just huge punted. I mean, I'm, I'm guessing they're going to cast a draw seven here and it won't matter, but this was a big mistake. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And before I redraw both of my Emer or Eldrazi again. Storm is hard to play. They might not have seen the line. They might not have remembered what was in their deck, you know? Uh, how many spells are we on? There's no Storm counter to tell me. One, two, three, four. Five with Seething Song. Oh, there it goes. Now the Storm Count's popping up. Yeah, we had two non-Storm decks that both 3-0'd. They were fantastic. Loved them. Yeah, Jace is a second Brainstorm, although it doesn't dig all that much deeper than the first. What you looking at, Cat? I don't got nothing for you. I'm a Null Rod. Baby tendrils? Yeah. All right. Or should I say seven drills?
Zero permanence. Yeah. Zero, you say? Hallelujah. All right, we'll take it. Well, we have a little bit of time.